Apple has more news with an iPhone announcement coming up this week. Hitachi has a battery that could last 10 years and a new robot can fold all your towels. It's Tuesday, April 6th. I'm Natalie Del Conte and it's time to get loaded. Apple sent out invitations for another big announcement this week having to do with the new iPhone operating system. I guess they figure while they have our attention from iPad, they might as well spring another biggie on us. Of course, we don't know for sure what this is about other than iPhone OS, but we're thinking it will allow the iPhone to have multitasking and turn-by-turn -turn navigation at a minimum. Hardware updates are not indicated on the invite, but that can't be too far behind. Not to be outdone, Microsoft also has a phone announcement on the way. CNET's Ina Fried is reporting an announcement could be made about Project Pink as early as next week. Pink is the code name for the mobile project that would bring Zoom software and social networking to mobile phones. This could be an actual phone, though, not just a software announcement. A media event is scheduled for next Monday in San Francisco. Google Buzz is going to let you change your privacy settings if you're among the many that are not happy with the way the feature shares your information with unwanted contacts. You'll be given the option to change that so the next time you click on the Google Buzz tab, you should be prompted with a confirmation page. The page will give users the chance to change their privacy settings so they know exactly who they're sharing their information with. Hitachi has developed a new lithium-ion battery that they claim will last 10 years. That's double the life of normal batteries, or in the case of some of my batteries, 10 times as much. The company says the new batteries could be used in smart grid applications that will help you monitor your usage and battery life. These batteries are expected to ship with products within the next year. Sony announced a new digital camera designed for the ladies. The Sony DSC W530D is the technical name, and Sony made some feminine tweaks to their new design. It'll come in jewel pink and precious white, both bedazzled with rhinestones. Aside from the design, it has 14 megapixels, 4 times optical zoom, and a 2.7 inch LCD. It also has face detection and captures 720p HD video. It goes on sale in Japan on April 23rd for around $290. Researchers at UC Berkeley have taught a robot to fold towels. The Willow Garage PR2 can roam an office in search of a power outlet as well as identify that a garment is in fact a towel and then fold it. Once it's folded, the towels can be neatly stacked. It can do up to 25 towels per minute, which is better than I can do. Although I think I fold towels a little more neatly, but if I had a robot folding all my towels, I might not be so picky. Those are all your headlines for today. Thank you for watching. I'll see you tomorrow with more. I'm Natalie Del Conte with CNET TV, and you've just been loaded.